So I got this woman who has loved me for 41 years. She loves me. She stays with me. I, 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 I make her crazy. She doesn't want to go any place. And she doesn't want to go into any, any public place with me because I do things that make people wonder if I'm okay. <laughs> and she's there and she gets embarrassed. But she still loves me. She stays with me. And I love her. And I, was at, I was at that same meeting. This guy comes up to me. By the way, I'm here tonight to tell you the truth. Okay? Someone defined humor this way. That humor is a gentle way to acknowledge human frailty. Humor is a gentle way to tell the truth so we can look at it and say, well, can we fix that? 41 years of marriage, I've been married. And this guy came up and lied to me. He did lie to me. He said, I've been married 41 years. He said, my wife and I have never had an argument. <laughs> He said, we've never raised our voice to one another. He said, we've never even had a bad thought toward one another. Now, I can't keep my mouth shut. I said, you're married to a carrot. <laughs> you are certainly not married to a woman who happens to be a human being. And human beings have conflict. Let me tell you something. Good marriage, and this is important for you younger people to listen to. Good marriage is not the absence of conflict. It's learning to work through conflict together. A good church isn't a church that never has trouble. A good church is a church that works through trouble together.